Hi guys, Mark from Custom Dynamics. Today I've got a cool uh, little product here to install for the uh, 15 to 23 road glides. Some yellow front turn signals to match our Shark Demon line. So uh, I'll meet you at the bike. All right guys, I'm here at the bike. I'm gonna install the front turn signals. Um, I'm gonna remove some stuff obviously because we always gotta remove some stuff. Um, I'm gonna start with removing the windshield screws, getting the windshield out of the way, setting it aside in a safe place. And we can remove the vent by pulling it straight up. Um, I always then unplug my turn signals because the connectors are right under the vent. Um, then we can move back to the interfering, remove the grills, uh, remove the lower screws on the wind deflectors on both sides. And then I always use one screw and put it right back in the windshield hole where, the, where it's at so the fairing doesn't fall off. Then I remove the two screws in the uh, speakers. Then we can also remove the uh, turn signal screws. Then we'll pull the fairing off with the turn signals, obviously they're attached there, and I'm gonna move that to the bench. So let me go ahead and do that real quick, and I'll meet you back at the bench. Okay, we have the uh, fairing on the bench here. We're gonna remove our turn signal and wire and everything here. Uh, first, you gotta cut the uh, cable tie off up there at the top, get it out of the way, let the cable down. And then these uh, foam sticky pieces, uh, you can peel them back and reuse them. Um, just be very careful because they will tear. Um, peel them back, get the wire down. But they're, they're quite sticky. Take it out of that and then we can remove our turn signal. We'll take our uh, socket, the Allen, loosen that up, get that out of the way, and we can feed the wire and everything through and pull the old turn signal out of the way. And this plastic piece kind of just slides back a little bit and then you can pull it off and you can get the wire and everything out. So we'll get that there out of the way. Now we're going to get our new turn signal with a gasket. Feed the wire through the gasket. Let it go down there. You're gonna have to line up the gasket. And we're gonna feed the wire through the hole and back through this plastic piece. And you can, once you get the uh, connector through, you can slide the, the plastic piece back in. Pull. Pull the wire through, and let me rotate this around for you. Let's see what I'm doing here. Make sure the gasket is the hardest part to keep it lined up right. But you pull the wire through. Slide it over, get that piece in. Kind of work it down till you see the gasket kind of even on both sides. That's pretty much it there. Then you can put the bolt back through. We supply new new bolts and everything for it. To get that started. Make sure the gasket's still good. Looks pretty good. Like so there. Then we can bring it back around here. We're Tighten this up, snug it up, and it has a little wire clip on the plastic piece, you want to run that through that, and then just feed it back up through those sticky foam pieces. And use a cable tie and tie that back up to there and that's pretty much it for the turn signal it is now mounted i'll get the other one put on and then i'll get it put back on the bike and i'll show you how to plug them in and we'll go from there all right i got the fairing back on I haven't put the vent back in there yet um here's our wire coming up from the uh turn signals 
And we also have on here, the customer has some uh, vent LEDs as well. So that wiring harness is there too. And all we're gonna do, the, the harness for the bike is here. Our turn signals can plug into the vent LEDs and then the vent LEDs will plug into turn signals. So you can double up on a lot of our stuff and more and uh, plug it all in and it'll all work. Just wanted to show you where the plugs were. Like I said, I already plugged this side in here um, with that. And then just, uh, I'm gonna wire tie these up here real nice and uh, get them tucked out of the way. And uh, then I can put the vent on. All right, guys, that wraps up our uh, install of the yellow front turn signals for the road glide here. And I will turn them on. As you can see, they are super bright. Um, they are a uh, running light, a yellow, and then when you hit the turn signal, they will still flash yellow. And as always, you can pick these up at your local drag specialties dealer and of course, customdynamics.com.